back. I hope you guys are well. We are going to get right to it. We are heading south. We are heading to Bridgeport, Connecticut to haul the boat out for the winter. We were a little bit bummed at first, but that's okay. We realized we had some very important boat jobs to do over the winter. And then in the summer, we will launch the boat, head to Buzzards Bay, and then off to the Bahamas. So stay tuned. Catch pond? Uh, you can catch them. I mean, there's a few left. They caught most of them. But, uh, you can catch them. I caught one last year. Little so cod, though. Little ones, yeah. They're, they're not they're big only, anymore. Like this big. When I was a kid, they were common to catch three, four foot cod. Fat tuna. Massachusetts. Just taking a walk. The harbor master will be bringing us to our boat because the launch service is closed. There's Isabella. Cool boat. We're hoping for a nice sail to Plymouth, Massachusetts. But look at this boat. National Historic Landmark, the Schooner Adventure. Wow, look at that, that's crazy. So cool. That's gonna be our ride right there, out to the boat. Coast Guard is also here in Gloucester. she is. Sailing vessel Pu'u Honua. Looking good. 
We will be heading south today towards the Cape Cod Canal. What was the rule about anchoring the chain? The general rule of thumb is for like a lunch anchor. So if you're only going to stay for a short time, and you're going to be on the boat, up and around, walking around, four to one, if it's mild. If you want to sleep, you usually do six or seven to one. And then if it's a hurricane, or if you think there's going to be a storm or something, then you put out all of your anchor chain and oh. three anchors. There's a variety of different strategies. Plymouth Rock is over there. We're not going on land. This is where the pilgrims came. We had a really nice night on anchor. The wind died down and the sunset was beautiful. Dinner was good. Um, we had to carefully consider the tide before leaving and, and going through the canal because if you don't, can have a really slow ride if you're going against the tide and against the current. So based on that tide chart, we had to be entering the canal around 8 a.m. This is interesting. Boats are all tied up. Hmm. Kind of cool. Stay in place. It's kind of like a dock. Oh, cool. They got like a weight that holds it back there. Right. Oh, yeah, and they have ladders. That's cool. We're going to see if this smoothie maker works. Rechargeable smoothie maker, USB. Put some ice and put some strawberries. Blackberries. Yeah. All right. In my blend of super greens, I've got spirulina, my collagen <coughs> protein powder, and then I have hemp seed for protein. Moment of truth. It exploded, oh. mother. Oh, yeah. Click subscribe, see what happens next. Things get a little bit scary in the Long Island Sound.